Welcome Leos. I'm back y'all with another video. Happy New Year to everyone who has celebrated the New Year. And for those who are celebrating in the spring, I'm going to be shouting y'all out in the spring too. Y'all know the vibes. Alright, so this is going to be for the month of January. So let's see what messages we get for you, okay? So this is a random read. Whatever pops out, pops out. This is what Spirit wants you to know. All right, so let's do it. Can you let's share the Leo, please. You're not sure where something is headed. You may feel kind of stuck. You're uncertain where something is going to go, where something is headed. I feel like something is on your mind. I feel like something is on your mind. Um, maybe you're trying to block it out, but it's there. Um, there's something, a choice that you need to make, um, or there's something that you're juggling. You know you need to make a decision. You feel like you need to make a decision. Um, the challenge is being patient, having some patience, okay? So with the Two of Pentacles here... I want to know more about this Two of Pentacles. You could also be juggling a lover, two lovers here. This could be a decision in love. Could be involving a King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, because we got King of Swords, Queen of Swords here. That was confirmation. You could be dealing with a soulmate or a twin flame. Or you two just get each other. Maybe you're trying to decide whether or not to block this person. Yeah. Something's being put on hold. I see that. A child involved could be in regards to like some type of connection with a child yeah I'm getting like waiting on a decision to be made okay so you're waiting for some decision to be made what is this about tell me more I see you being a lot of waiting here. Having patience because there's a waiting game. Like, I'm getting, like, the waiting game. <laughs> it's a waiting game right now. You're waiting for somebody to make a decision or you're waiting to make some type of decision. On whether or not if you're going to be single. you want to move forward possibly with a king of pentacles virgo taurus capricorn or a fire sun leo sagittarius aries i'm getting like something is very like on again off again as well i'm getting a lot of uh 
maybe there's a disagreement that that you could have possibly just went through with with someone. The moon and the emperor. This could have something to do with a Pisces or a Cancer or an Aries, or this could be someone's father, someone's baby father, someone's um, someone could be older. I'm seeing, I'm hearing you say, I hope not. All right. So, I definitely want to see why you're in the Queen of Swords energy. Because you're in your no-nonsense energy. Um, there's something that you've been waiting on. You've been waiting for this some type of decision to be made. So I see you being really in a no-nonsense energy. Like your guard is up. You could be... Um, yeah, see, I'm getting like there was a temporary... Like there was an argument. Okay, we got the Knight of Wands and the Five of Wands. So there could have been an argument, disagreement. So it looks like you're upset about something. I'm seeing you not wanting to cut somebody off, but you're considering it. That's what I see. Um, you feel like this connection has stood the test of time, but you're considering it. I feel like you are considering Cutting this person off. Maybe you're losing patience. I see an argument for sure. Yep. Maybe you're trying to avoid drama. You're trying to avoid um, drama or avoiding things getting taken too far. I see you kind of like distancing yourself with the hermit card here. Trying to avoid drama. I feel like you're losing patience. There could be a fire sign involved. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Now, this person you could be dealing with is King of Swords. Um, they could carry this energy. So, both of you, both of you and this person could be like a no-nonsense type of energy. So for some, this is a baby mother, baby father energy. We got the empress and the emperor here. This could be a baby mother, baby father. Maybe you're considering like blocking this person or like not going into the new year with this person. Um, this could be a husband, wife, boyfriend, girlfriend. Like you make you guys maybe a power couple. But I'm picking up. I'm picking up that um, somebody's thinking that they're perfect. Maybe. You're looking at it like, you know, this person is perfect for you or this person is coming off like they do everything right. Like they're so perfect. I feel like you feel like this in the past. You felt like, well, it's good enough for me. It's good enough for me. It's perfect enough for me. And I feel like you don't want to, you don't want this connection to end, but you, you're considering it. Maybe you're trying to avoid drama. You're losing patience. And then we got the lovers here. So you love this person. You don't want to let this connection go. Yep. We got the four of cups, but I see you 
being bored with the connection. Maybe um, you're not sure how to communicate with this person moving forward or how to express yourself. Somebody could be going to the internet, running to the internet. Why is the Four of Cups here? There's some disappointment or you don't feel loved. Oh, okay. You love this person, even though this person may not have a lot of money. This person may not have um, much to offer. Um, but this person could offer you, when I say not much to offer, I'm, I'm talking material-wise, but this person may offer you other things in different areas that help complete you. So this goes back to this energy where it says, they're perfect for me. This person is perfect for me. But you're trying to avoid a disagreement. So there's someone in the picture who disagrees with this logic here. There's someone who disagrees with this logic. It could be a family member. All the cards flew out. <laughs> okay. Could be a family member. This person could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They feel like money is everything. With the Temperance, King of Pentacles, and the Ace of Cups. They feel like money is everything. Um, This person may run to the internet. I keep getting somebody's run to the internet and um, getting information from the internet. Somebody feels like somebody's trying to make them look bad. Um, this is a big decision for you. This is a big decision for you. Um, but I, I, I don't really see you giving up on this person. I see you not wanting to block this person out your life. I see you feeling like this person is perfect for you. They could uh, shower you with a lot of attention. And that's what you like about this person. situation is real toxic though it's extremely toxic and it needs to be balanced out and that's the problem there's no balance in the situation this this um somebody's too attached too clingy too attached there needs to be some type of balance i'm also hearing for some of you, y'all need to clean up your ho your homes. Y'all should have, listen, I'm not y'all mama, but I just saw that somebody saying like, somebody needs to clean up their home, organize their home. Okay. I'm getting like there could be like a stepfather involved. I 
I'm hearing somebody saying that somebody can get out. So it, it's, it's somebody saying that somebody seems like they are broke, okay? Like, this person that you could be dealing with, like, they... Their energy is the Five of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. Could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This person doesn't bring materials to the table. They don't bring anything material to the table. But this person could offer, like, this is what I'm saying. Like, this person could offer a lot of attention. They they may sh they may love bomb you. They may love bomb you. Let's see. We can find out more about this person. This King of Cups energy. Somebody does not like this relationship. It could be a dad or a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, male, stepfather, stepmother. What is this King of Cups energy? What is their energy? Maybe there is talks about taking things to the next level, a partnership, a commitment, possibly even like engagement in the near future. But this person feels like if this person loves you, then they would mirror your energy. Like, the golden mirror is somebody who is love bomb you. And I said that. I said that this person may love bomb you, give you a lot of attention. And that's how they show you, show their love to you. Tell me more about this energy. I don't feel like, I don't feel like your family likes this person. dragonfly so this person energy like this person energy is a dragonfly be lighthearted, finding out things coming to light adapt change and heal this person could be need to heal or trying to heal they're adapting they're making some type of changes because i see something was sabotaged Something was sabotaged, they, and they're trying to rebuild. This person is trying to rebuild. This person is trying to rebuild. And then it looks like Cupid's arrow hit you. Having faith. Love is coming. So you could have been looking for love. And then this person asked you out on a date. But see, this person got a jack. This person got a handful of cards. So this person could have a few different options. But they took a chance and they took a risk. They're being super duper strategic. They may have a lot of options. And they're not going to show you their hand. So be careful with this person. I feel like your family doesn't like this person. They feel like this person needs to step their game up. That's what this is. I don't necessarily feel like it because is a stepfather or something like that. I feel like your family doesn't like this person because they feel like they need to step their game up. That's what this is. Your family feels like this person needs to step it up. This person could be a king of cups. King of cups, a Leo, 
or a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or Vir yeah, I said Virgo, or King of Swords, Super Gemini, Aquarius. So that's all signs. So it really does it is really not specific on the sign, but I feel like it, yeah, your your family doesn't like this person. So they feel like you do you do everything for this person. If you got the butterfly, okay. So the relationship is evolving in the next phase, healing and inner child and growth. So this person got a lot of growth. They need to grow up and learn how to make better choices. We got healthy choices here, especially with their money, abundance. They could drink a lot. They could drink a lot. They socialize a lot. With their social life, they probably spend a lot of money on, you know, on alcohol or partying, whatever it is. This person is irresponsible with their finances. All right. So that's the message that I got for you, Leos. All right. So if this message resonated, be sure to hit the like button as well as share with your family and your friends. Subscribe if you are new. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.